I think passion can be quite porous, a flicker of a feeling that is so true and so quick, but perhaps you're changed by it forever. So I think to leave room for that sort of magic, that vulnerability, I think to me intensity is that. In the last two years, I've really fallen in love with dance in a much more truthful, beautiful way. It's like a whole new experience now rediscovering dance because now I'm doing it with such like wonder and willingness to appreciate every nuance, every move, every the meaning behind everything. The key to bringing focus in a moment of performance, I think, is to truly let go and to truly transcend because only when there is hysteria can there be magic. Only when there is absolute submission can there be transcendence. So I don't think one can experience the pleasure and the wonder of art until they become it. You know, like how they say there is no separation between the dance and the dancer sometimes. That moment, it's so rare to come by even for some of the most extraordinary performers. The first time I had met with the team at Her Story, I was actually very taken aback by the kind of authenticity that they were after because I couldn't quite believe that someone was so very invested in making someone, consumer, the wearer, the admirer, the audience, feel seen, feel beheld. As for Gungurus, they've always been a symbol of sanctity of some kind, also a symbol of grace. Also at the same time, they're not kind always. They are heavy, they're around your ankles and they ground you. You are so in tune with every step you take, whether it's the right beat, pay the foot landing on the ground. So the gunguru is a harsh critic, but a very rewarding one. It's an ancient sound and I feel a connection to it that seems very extraordinary, otherworldly. And I don't think we've had jewelry inspired by the gunguru, which is actually so Indian, so ancient, so culturally relevant and so romanticized and beautiful. It just came together, poetry in motion, the lines underneath, the gunguru inspiration. I just had to belong with this collection. It was love at first sight. <laughs>